Greetings and salutations. I'm re-recording this because, uh, okay, I've been using my phone to record all the um, video from on down the shed. It's very useful because cameras, you can be pretty close up and still get a nice feel of view. Uh, they're small, they're handy. Nowadays, the, the quality is phenomenally good. And I don't have to bring my bulky camera down here where I can't see what's going on. And that leads me to my first point. Uh, I've been using the selfie side of the camera for all these videos so far. Mostly so I can monitor what's going on on the screen. That's also so I can bring things up close, I can get in close, and it's good to monitor. You know, film background. Problem is with selfie cameras, they tend to autofocus, so they tend to that, so they have this kind of shifting that constantly goes on, as it's just micromanaging that focus constantly. I'm using the back camera, the bigger camera, the higher quality camera, whatever. The problem is, of course, now I can't see behind the actual camera to see if everything's fully in frame. So if I'm in frame, great. If I'm not, well, we'll deal with it. I'm going to graphite rub my Ghostbusters chest piece. I've painted it in gray. Um, I'm probably going to switch to the footage I took earlier um, because I'm re-recording this because I'm having some technical issues. but. And as I snap, I'm going to pick up the uh, piece, and it's completely finished, like almost like I've already done this. So I don't know if that's going to work with the glove. seen all me rubbing it down 20 minutes ago so yeah I'm I'm really happy with this the gray works great again it could probably be a little bit lighter um, Vegas can't be choose I really like this effect uh, I'm still gonna be experimenting with all the different types of paints and stuff for the mechleths I'm going to get an end pop but for this that's gonna be brilliant that's gonna sit right there and it's going to tie in with visually with the rest of the Ghostbusters costume. In the cartoon, it's just a grey box thing. So it doesn't need to be metal, but visually it looks a little bit better. Same with the um, 
the goggle pieces. So I've already done them. I might take a photo and post this over this. But in there, they're just brown. But you can allude to copper. Other Ghostbusters characters, cosplayers, they tend to use copper eyes melons for that because yeah, the brass and everything looks better. And same with this. I think having it as a, a, a metallic grey is really visually going to make this look really good. Now, it's could I have spent more time prepping the surface? Probably, yeah. Uh, do I really honestly care that much? No. Please like, share, subscribe, all that usual guff, and uh, look forward to talking to you again. See ya.